What is up everybody, JT Dangerously here once again. I am back for my Fave Fives for week 17. Of course, week 17 just ended today, so I thought of doing my Fave Five right now. Of course, these are what I think are the top five performers of today. Of course, you have your opinions. Of course, put if there's any honorable mentions, let me know in the comments below. Of course, um, if you did not see out my the video I put up this morning, we did hit 100 subscribers on the channel, so I hope you guys... Um, of course, check it out. Uh, again, cannot cannot be thankful enough. We got to 100 on New Year's Day. Cannot get any better than that. So let's get right into these week. Let's get right into the favorite. I'm starting at the number five position this week. Rex Burkhead out of the Cincinnati Bengals, running back. 27 rushings, 27 rush, uh, 27 carries, 119 yards, two touchdowns. Even in even uh, in blowing out Baltimore on Sunday. So. Even though, uh, what do you call it, Cincinnati's out of the playoffs, at least one player showed up for their team, and that was Rex Burkhead, their running back. So Rex Burkhead from Cincinnati is number five on the list. Now the number four man on my Faith Five list, Zach Ernst, the tight end for the Philadelphia Eagles. What did he do this week? 13 receptions, 139 yards, two touchdowns. And another, uh, after knocking off the Dallas Cowboys on Sunday tonight. So even another team that's, out of playoff contention, but they, they sh uh, certain players showed up for them. That was Zach Ernst, their tight end. So definitely, that was a big time win for them for sure. And now my number three uh, man in the top, in my faith five, Sam Bradford from the Minnesota Vikings, twenty five for thirty three, two hundred and five yards, three touchdowns, and a one pick. Of course, it's been a rocky, very rocky year for the Minnesota Vikings, of course. Sam Bradford taking over for where Teddy Bridgewater was hurt. So it was a very rough, not an easy season for the Buffalo Bills. That, I mean, the Minnesota Vikings, that's for sure. But that was a big-time game beating the Chicago Bears to finish up the season. So Sam Bradford is number three. Number two on my Faith Five list, of course, is Tom Brady. 25 of 33, 276 yards, three touchdowns over the Miami Dolphins. Now, of course... His record is not great against Miami, but I had a good feeling he was gonna they were gonna get it done today and get home field advantage throughout the AFC playoffs for sure. So Tom Brady is number two. And now the number one quarterback that made my Faith Five list is Matt Ryan from the Atlanta Falcons. Twenty seven of thirty six, three hundred and thirty one yards, four touchdowns, no picks. So and with Atlanta went beating New Orleans, they are the number two seed, home field, uh, first round bye, of course. So they will be playing next week. And Atlanta definitely needed this win because, again, it was against the AFC South Saints, against Drew Brees, and they got it done at home. And Matt Ryan got it done with four touchdowns. So Matt Ryan is number one for me for Week 17. And those are my Fave Five for Week 17. I hope you guys enjoyed my Fave Fives this week. Comment below who do you have. In your fave five, honorable mentions. I know there was a few honorable mentions. Aaron Rodgers had four touchdowns this week. But, um, again, to your guys' opinion, let me know. Let's have a conversation about it. Please like, comment, and subscribe and become part of this, this bigger Dangerous Alliance. And I will see you in the next video. See ya.